Oh, hi! Uh, you caught us uh, taking care of our plans. In a second, we'll be with you, okay? Uh, perfect, now. Now we are ready to show you how to play. Ouch! Oh, poor cactus. And poor me. So, as we were saying, we're going to show you how to play Ouch, a game designed by Romain Catergen and Theo Rivière and with art by Frank Collado. This is one of our pocket games, you know, lots of fun in the smallest space. And it's a game for two to five players that lasts about 20 minutes maximum. In Ouch, you are going to visit a desert uh, you will be there just to collect uh, flowers from the cactus, but uh, paying attention because the more beautiful the cactus are, the more dangerous. So if you are pricked, uh, you won't be able to take the flowers. Let's take a look to how to play Ouch. So inside the box you will find, like in all our pocket games, the rules and some cards. In our case, cards uh, shows um, a real nice cactus, a flowered cactus on one side, and in the other you have a landscape with thorns, flowers, and in some of the cards you have uh, wild animals. Okay. So to uh, prepare the game, just shuffle all the cards uh, with the cactus uh, faced up, and place six of the cards at the center of the playing zone. And with that, you're ready to start playing uh, Ouch. In this game, players will alternate turns until the end of the game that will happen once a player has eight cards in front of them or when the deck runs out of cards, so whatever happens first, okay? And what are you going to do in your turn? You just have to select one of the six available cards and choose one of the sides. For example, let's say that we choose that card and we're going to flip it from that side. Then two things can happen. Okay, in our case, there are no thorns here, so we are safe. We take the card and we put it in front of us. Those flowers are ours. But it can also happen that uh, you Let's take that one uh, from up here. If you have the thorns here, you're prick. You have to say, ouch. And of course, you cannot take the flowers. So the card are this, is this card or goes back to the box. Okay, it's out of the game. And that's it, that's all. Once you have take the card, if you take it or if it goes to the discards, just put a new one and continue playing that way until the end of the game. There are, two, three rules that um, add some difficulty to the game, but it's not really difficult. First one, with the red flowers, if you are pricked with the red flowers, by taking red flowers, okay, let's say that we're pricked, ouch! You have to discard that card, of course, because you're pricked. And uh, also one that you had in front of you. Okay, so two cards. But at the end of the game, the player with more red flowers uh, will uh, get five extra points. Also, as you saw, there are some cards with uh, wild animals. So if you take one of the cards with a wild animal, for example, let's say that we have that one, we keep it, you can use uh, their abilities. Okay, with the Fennec, you can take an extra turn. But knowing that if you're prick with the next card, I'm not prick, but if you were prick, you have to discard that card and also the Fennec one. And with the snake, what happens is that if you take the snake, okay, the next player, if that player get, uh, is pricked by the card, instead of discarding the card, uh, they must uh, give it the card to you. Okay, so that's the only thing, okay, with the Fennec an extra turn, with the snake, you take the card uh, from the next player if uh, that player is pricked. And that's it, you continue playing until a player arrives to eight cards in front of them or you run out of cards and it's time to check the final score. How are you going to score in this game? Okay, you're going to score, in, uh, to score sorry, four number of flowers. So in our case, it's one, two, three, four, five flowers. Okay, those are five points. 
You will score also four complete sets. That means one flower of each color. Let's pretend that we have that here. We will score four points because we have one purple, one blue, one white, and one red. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, because of the flowers, plus four because of the completed set. And as we said before, the player with more red flowers is going to score five extra points. And that's it. At the end, the, uh, the player with more points will be the one who have, more, who have moved uh, more cunningly in the desert and will be the winner of the game. The interesting thing about this game is that, uh, you saw, it's a, it's a game for young people, actually. It's not a complicated game. But you can uh, skip the rules uh, of the red flowers and the animals and score just for number of flowers, uh, not, uh, not because of the completed sets. And with those rules, you adapt the game to the youngest ones at home. So it's perfect uh, to play uh, as a family. And that's it. That's Zouch, a really funny game that will play with your, uh, with your tension every time that you're flipping a card. We hope you enjoy the game and remember to keep playing. Bye.